नेक्स्ट इज हाइड्रोस्फेयर सो हाइड्रोस्फेयर इज दार्ट ऑफ अर्थ सरफेस विच इज कवर्ड बाई वॉटर सो एज द नेम इज सजेस्टिंग हाइड्रोस्फेयर ऑल दी वॉटर येस ऑल दी पार्ट विच इज कवर्ड विद वॉटर वी नो दैट अराउंड सेवेंटी वन परसेंट ऑफ द अर्थ सरफेस इज कवर्ड विद वॉटर सो दिस एरिया दैट कूड बी वॉटर मीन्स दैट डजेंट मीन्स ओनली ओशंस दैट कंटेन सी लेक्स रिवर्स बेज आइस ग्लेशियर्स ग्राउंड वॉटर फ्रेश वॉटर टूगेदर दे ऑल मेक इट वॉट इज हाइड्रोस्फेयर सो हाइड्रोस्फेयर सेवेंटी वन परसेंट ऑफ अर्थ सरफेस इज कवर्ड विद वॉटर एंड दैट इज द रीजन अर्थ इज ऑल्सो नोन एज वॉटरी प्लानट सो वॉटर वी नो दैट वी सपोर्ट वॉटर इन ऑल फॉर्म ऑफ लाइफ येस वॉटर सपोर्ट्स ऑल फॉर्म ऑफ लाइफ ऑन द अर्थ एंड इट इज़ यूजफुल इन नंबर ऑफ वेज वी नो दैट फ्रेश वॉटर वी यूज इट फॉर डोमेस्टिक वी यूज इट फॉर ड्रिंकिंग एग्रीकल्चर इंडस्ट्रियल यूजेज एवरी थिंग टू जनरेट इवन इलेक्ट्रिसिटी हाइड्रो इलेक्ट्रिक पार्ट्स आर देयर ऑन द रिवर्स टू टू जनरेट इलेक्ट्रिसिटी सो इट इज ऑल्सो वन ऑफ द मीन्स ऑफ ट्रांसपोर्ट्स नाउ वी आर बिल्डिंग नेशनल वाटर वेज लाइक सेम एज वी हैव नेशनल हाईवेज सो इट इज ऑल्सो वन ऑफ दू कैन से दोसेस विच इज बाई विच द वॉटर साइकिल रनस on the other hand oceans provide us food yes minerals like petroleum we get petroleum from mumbai high which is present in arabian sea that is the oceanic bed of arabian sea so this is what the hydrosphere is next come to atmosphere so atmosphere as we know that it is a blanket of air that involves the earth around so the blanket of air is which involves around the earth is called atmosphere exact thickness of this atmosphere goes up to 1600 km so 1600 km from the surface of earth so gravitational force the earth due to the gravitational force the earth rotate and hold atmosphere around it so it is a mixture of many gases nitrogen oxygen and argons and rest carbon dioxide and many others so nitrogen 78% of the constituents composition of the air is nitrogen after that 21% is oxygen and rest carbon dioxide argon water vapors dust smoke particles that constitutes around 1% of the gases but when we come to the third gas when it comes to the abundance argon a r g o n is the gas which is the third abundant gas in the atmosphere so atmospheres it's also yes prevent us from these harmful sun rays ultraviolet rays which can cause cancer and cataract disease so it also at the same time atmosphere also control the temperature during day and night it also control the pressure humidity and sunshine so therefore the atmosphere helps us in changement of the weather and the climate this is all about the atmosphere next is biosphere so biosphere is a place where all the three spheres in which the life sustain meets that means the rare range in which the land water and air meets in which that results to the interactions of living organisms so all the spheres where life exist due to the land water and atmosphere that is called as that zone is called as 
biosphere. This biosphere is the unique variety with due to which earth supports a lot of living organisms and it forms a great balance in the nature and this yes separate our earth from rest of the solar system so the variety of life which biosphere do that is known as biodiversity biodiversity of life means number of species present in a particular area constitutes the biodiversity of that area next one more concept related to biosphere biodiversity only that is ecosystem what is an ecosystem so ecosystem is an area or you can say a system in which a group of organisms in a area interact with each other live together with their non living environment that means a particular area in which different species of plants animal interact and they live together with living as well as non living environment so this is what is called ecosystem 